God is not going to be with Kimba once he gets famous, bro. Understand that shit. He's not going to be with y'all. What's good, doers? You know what it is. You know what it is. It's your boy uh, back with another reaction video. Before we get into this, you know what to do. Hit the like button, share button, subscribe button. Comment what you want to see us do next. Let's jump into what's going on here, man. Lifeless Garments is on time, and he got 10 toes to the pavement. And he's letting everybody know, including Ken Carson, that he on whatever you want, respectfully. So if you know, you know. Ken Carson took to social media and decided to diss Lifeless Garments, Southside Silhouette, and rolling thracks you know there's an infamous um bar going around now like i said before man it's a pretty interesting bars from ken carson left me pretty impressed lifeless garments is not gonna let the underground rap titan ken carson play with his name without there being any repercussions you know what I'm so let's see what he had to say here with a response I'm surprised Life is Garments isn't afraid to take shots back at Ken Carson, you know, do with the allegations and everything. It's easy to shit on him. It's very, very easy to shit on him. Even if his song is better, people are just gonna bring up the allegations. Like, usually there are artists out there, everybody thinks they're Cardi. People will take a situation like this to act like they don't need to respond to Ken Carson, use the clout, and just blow up off that. Nah, he the first one out the bunch to take shots back. Now, there's a video I wanna talk about because like I said before in a couple of my videos when I talk about this thing, it's like, yo, why are they doing this? You know what I'm saying? Like, it ain't no real smoke. Y'all niggas don't, I like, I could look at kids and tell them niggas don't got real smoke. You know what I'm saying? And then I came across this video here. If it was, I'll have one out. There was no beef. There needs there was to be. No, there was no beef between me and that nigga. That nigga was just, like, puffing his chest because, like, the nigga was basically trying to call me out for sounding like him. You feel me? Like, that's all it was. Why are we still talking about this? That shit is, that, like, for <laughs> anybody that has recently seen that shit, that shit is, like, four years old. That shit that is old. That video is four years old. That came out quarantine. Like, I was, like, I was, like, 17 or, like, 18 when, when that, when he did when that When the shit. live did it? And mind you, like, like, he did live, at, sure. at, at that point in time, I'm, like, damn near, like, damn, like, I fucked with that nigga music and I looked up to that nigga and then, like, it was, like, an idol moment for me type shit, like. Don't ever meet your idols type shit moment for me. That shit is what put me on track to like do my shit like and get right. I like, just couldn't fuck with him, bro. Like, After that shit, I just could not fuck with him. Bro. Like it's not that I don't even fuck with bro. But like, you, like I brought up the South Side Silhouette video. You know, I know it has nothing to do with the lifeless garments this, but I wanted to like retouch on that topic. I myself was curious about what's going on between opium and this new bunch of artists. You know what I'm saying? Being a being that like y'all artists that keep to yourself and speak on nobody and don't really pass around clout at all. And you're like to an extent, make sure y'all not passing around any amounts of clout in any way, shape, form, fashion. Why do y'all choose to do so when it's time to shit on people? Especially after a year where all it were like the, the industry basically brought y'all to success, decided to pick y'all as the artists for the year type shit the runway and 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 you know what i'm saying and now y'all gonna take that and look back and start shitting on people that y'all don't got beef with that that just don't make sense to me be that honest with you but i'm definitely gonna keep my eyes on south side silhouette life as garments and rolling thrax especially this year because why not clearly the under the radar of who we have our eyes on so 
Why not tap in to see what they have to offer? I already heard what South South Silhouette got to offer. I already heard what Rolling Thatch got to offer. I heard what Life is Garments got to offer. I reacted to all of them before any of this ever went down. Anyway, a little bit about the diss from Life is Garments. I will say that the diss was the diss was cool. Didn't really sound too much like a diss. More so just like a response, like more so just like a hit record in response to Ken Carson shining some type of attention on him that's definitely what you should do and respect y'all let me know what you guys think of the lifeless garments this y'all let me know what you guys think about just the situation in general in the comments y'all already know what it is it's your boy a god hit the like button share button subscribe button comment what you want to see us do next peace <laughs> Just be, if King Mel gets famous, y'all niggas not gonna be with King Mel once he gets famous, bro. Understand that shit. He not gonna feed y'all.